Every year, thousands of front gardens are paved over. There's no better way to destroy the valley of your street. Traditionally, the front of the house and the pavement are places where neighbours greet each other. Planted front gardens absorb rainfall. That reduces the risk of flooding and replenishes the groundwater that we depend on for water supplies. Planted front gardens are good for diversity and they improve the climate and air quality. Destroying the front hedge, fence or wall and turning the front garden into a parking lot makes the street less sociable. Walking isn't pleasant where gardens have been turned into private parking lots. Cars reverse over the pavement, making it unsafe for children. That encourages parents to drive their children to school, which increases the amount of traffic and the danger to the few children who do walk. It's a vicious circle. In paved front gardens, rainwater runs down the drain, wasted. When the drains can't cope, every paved front garden increases the risk of flooding. Paving front gardens reduces biodiversity. To park on their front gardens, people build crossovers and drop curbs. That means no one else can park on that stretch of street. Parking has been privatised, denying everyone else the flexible parking that a street can provide. Converting front gardens to parking spaces seems to be contagious. It's ugly, and in the long run, it devalues the street. Let's not do it. If you must park in your front garden, make it permeable. Plant it. Create some structure. And give the pavement an edge. And where the front garden has been paved, let's rebuild the boundaries and get planting.